Hello everyone! Welcome to WWE Universe Mode! Sorry to spring you on all of a sudden, but we're already getting into our first match of the night! And tonight, we have got a great opening match for you to start off right after Payback. And tonight, to open, we have Alexa Bliss. Tonight, she's looking to prove herself. The real question is, can she do it? Let's find out, because she has a very tough opponent. Look at it all, and it's Rhea Ripley, who's running down to the ring, attacking Bliss. But Bliss getting an upper hand there, stopping Ripley from attacking her. But let's see what happens now. There's the bell. And now... Bliss, no, Rhea slaps and kicks her away, but now there's Bliss anyway. This is an interesting match. Rhea Ripley, your WWE Women's Champion for Monday Night Raw, the world's Women's Champion. And tonight, she takes on a tough competitor. Here's a roll-up, but no, that's not going to be enough to defeat the champ. Rhea Ripley... Looks to prove just how strong she is by beating somebody like Bliss. But it's, of course, like I said, no easy task. But look at the strength of Rhea here. Oh, what a suplex. Rhea is not just going to give up so easily. And now here we go with the count. And oh no, Bliss with a kick out at two and a half, keeping this match going. Here's, look at this, Bliss got her and takes down Ripley, trying to change the tide of this match. The question is, can she do it? And now there it goes down Rhea Ripley. Both of these women have a lot of fight in them. Rhea Ripley, though, may have more fight. Here's a roll-up, though. No, a kick out at one by Ripley. And again, Bliss with the roll-up. Here's another pin and a kick out at one. Bliss was trying to seal win multiple times, but couldn't stop Rhea. And look at... Oh, my God, what a clothesline. That might be enough to beat her right there. Oh, look at this. Just look at the pain. Bliss is going through. There's a kick. And now there's a punch. Got her up. And now we are Ripley. Dropping Bliss. Lights go out. What is this? Bliss standing behind Ripley. And there's a takedown. What the hell just happened? Ripley. Confused just like the rest of us. But Bliss, definitely not confused here. Look at this. Another takedown by Bliss. She has changed how this match is going. She changed the tide of this match. By killing the lights, it seems, somehow. And Bliss... No, wait a second. Oh, my God. What a slam on the concrete floor by Rhea Ripley. And now picking up Bliss and slamming her head. Just dropping her. That is not going to feel good tomorrow. And now Ripley throws her in the ring. Pick has Alexa and a punch to the back. Not giving Bliss any rest. Picking her up. Ripley. There's a kick by Bliss to stop her. Now here's Bliss with another takedown. Bliss has not been at a good point so far in this match. 
trying to like really change the tide by completely dominating for a, at least a little bit. But Rhea just refusing to quit. Look at this. Bliss with the DDT. Is that enough to beat Ripley? And oh, a kick out at two and a half. How close was that one there? And look at Ripley with the roll up. Can she steal it? At two. No. A kick out by Bliss. What's Ripley got in store for us now? There's a punch to the back. And another punch to the back. Has Bliss. Here's a pin. Looking to win it right here. No. Kick out by Bliss. Rhea now stomping on the head of Bliss and again. But this time Rhea has got the prism trap locked in. Is that going to be enough to make Bliss tap? Has her in the, t the prism trap. Has it locked in? Oh, look at this. Bliss flips her around. Stopping Ripley there. And now into the ropes. Look at that. What a slam. And now. Here we go. Bliss has the arm. Oh my goodness. The arm of Rhea. Oh, but there's a kick by Rhea. Oh, misses a drop kick. There's a kick by Bliss. And now look at the right hands by Bliss here. Oh, and just slapping Rhea across the face. Bliss, middle row. And there's a cross body. Bliss now. Oh, look at the repeated stomps. Bliss has given herself a much better chance than she had before. And look at this. It's all to injury. Bliss, top row. Bliss with the twisted bliss. This is to win it. Is this it? No. Ripley kicks out. Bliss can't believe it. Bliss can't believe it. And neither can I. After what Ripley's gone through, the fact that she kicked out either shows heart, determination, or spite in all honesty. The spite could be coming from just being underrated in her past. Now, and a lot of people say she can't win without the Judgment Day, but tonight, so far, she's proving that she is capable of holding her own. But Bliss, once again, stops Ripley from doing anything serious. There she goes into the ropes. Oh, Bliss missed there with the hit. Oh, and there's a clothesline, though, by Bliss. Has Rhea. And now there's Noah block punch instead. Ripley has her on the rope now. Throws her into the other one. Misses a drop kick. A little too early on that one. Here's Rhea. Throws her into the ropes there. Is that enough to win it? This is. Oh, no. I thought it was it there. Instead, a kick out by Bliss once again. And now Ripley, what a kick to the face. That might knock her out there. And now Ripley, look at this. No, Alexa stops her. The punch and out elbow. Bliss now, what she got in store here. Takes her down and Bliss, there's the kick. Right to the face of Ripley. And now, Rhea in the corner. Rhea stops Bliss. What's she going to do? There's a drop kick. Rhea rolling to the outside here. Rhea, no, now back into the inside. Calling Bliss up, trying to get her in that ring. What has Rhea got in store for us here? And now, throw Bliss has advantage again. And another takedown. We've seen this many times. Bliss taking control all of a sudden. And look at Bliss here. Slamming her down on the mat. 
And now here's a pin. Can Bliss win it with that? No. May have given Rhea too much time to recover thinking about going to the corner there. That may have just cost her the matchup. But of course, it's not over. Bliss, what she got in store for us next? And again, slamming Rhea down. Bliss going to the top here. What's she going to do? Oh, she went for Twisted Bliss, but she missed. Ripley. What's Ripley got here? Ripley, oh my god. Got the prism trapped. Locked in again. Bliss might not be able to get out of this one. That is a sincere lock. That is tight. Let her go. Oh my goodness. This is too much. No way, no. Bliss gets out of it. And now, look at this. A uh, kick to the face of Bliss. Bliss did that earlier to Ripley. Now it's Rhea got. Look at this. Rhea Ripley. Riptide. By Rhea Ripley. Here's the pin. To win it. Oh my god. How in the hell did Rhea kick out? And look at this, picks her up, and the, oh my goodness, the spike slam, and now once again, Rhea going for, no, Bliss blocks it, there's a punch, and now Bliss throws her down, and now take her down, Bliss, oh my goodness, trying to separate her arms from her body. And now Bliss with insult to injury. Here's a pin to win it. No. How did Rhea kick out? But I don't think she'll be able to kick out of the DDT. Oh, and Bliss with the pin, and no, oh my god, Ripley kicking out. How did Rhea kick out there? Look at this, Rhea out of the way, and now Bliss takes her down anyway. There's a drop kick by Bliss. What has Bliss got? Here, oh, a jump from the middle rope. Bliss again, this time going to the top rope. And now Bliss calling Rhea up. And drop kick. What a match it's been. And is that enough to end this great matchup? No, it's not. Ripley with another kick out. Oh, and, uh, and Bliss looking to put it in the final touches with that DDT. Here's the pin. Bliss has done it. No, oh my God. A kick out by Rhea Ripley. No, Mr. Boot. And now, look at this. There she, Bliss sends Rhea into the corner. Has her on the top. There's a punch. Oh, and there's a kick by Rhea, stopping Bliss. There's a punch. And Miss is there. Whatever she was planning to do. And Bliss, the DDT, out of nowhere. Here it is. Oh, are you kidding me? How much fight? Do these women have? I can't believe it. Rhea and Bliss have given it their anything, everything. And it's only the first match of the night. This doesn't matter, guys. God. No, wait a second. Bliss missed it there. There's a punch by Bliss. And now, Sunset Flip! On the outside, that is not gonna feel good. 
That has got to be a huge move in this match. That could be it. Honestly, for Rhea there. On the concrete. And now Bliss back in the ring. What she got? Oh, right on the back. Bliss now. Look at this. Drop kick. And now Bliss insult to injury. Here's the pin. Is that enough? Yes, it is. Bliss picks up a huge victory to start the night after payback. What a match. These two women just had. But in the end, Bliss will come away with the victory. So, folks, I appreciate you for watching. But, of course, we have more coming up. So, we will be back in one second for the next match. Thank you. We'll be back. And we are back on Monday Night Raw, folks. And first coming out, we have the leader of Alpha Academy. It is Chad Gable. What a chance for Chad Gable tonight to make a statement. And, be, and that reason to make a statement is because his opponent is a member of the Judgment Day. His opponent is Senor Money in the Bank. It is Damien Priest. Damien Priest. He's looking to dismantle Chad Gable tonight and show that no faction stands a chance against them. And now, Damian Priest making his way into the ring. Tonight, he means business. He is not playing around. He wants to make this quick and sweet for the Judgment Day. But now, let's actually get this match started and see what goes on in this match. Damian Priest versus Chad Gable. Here we go. The fans chanting Gable. There's the bell, look at this. Oh my goodness, Chad pushed Damian. And oh, look at this. We've heard some insults from the Judgment Day to Alpha Academy lately. And clearly, Chad Gable is not happy about that. But Wall tried to attack Damien. Down went the ref. But now, Chad taking advantage on the outside. He goes back into the ring. And look at this. Chad Gable back to the outside once again, trying to bring the fight to Priest, who now goes with the punches, and Damien, oh my god, using his elbows to crush the head of Chad Gable, but now Chad Gable has an advantage here with these punches and kicks, and a takedown, taking out the legs of Damien Priest, and all throwing and again, just slamming him into that barricade. And oh my goodness, what a move. Chad Gable leaving Priest on the outside here. Chad Gable, oh, thank you. Let's go, Chad. Damian Priest has been a crooked, crooked man lately. Disappointing all the fans when he won Money in the Bank a couple months ago. 
But now, look at this. Can he dismantle the fans tonight by beating Chad Gable, a fan favorite right now? Boom, there's a takedown. Chad Gable has been having some issues with also Gunther Imperium. Maybe that will come into play in this match. But you can, you never know. Anyways, here's Gable throwing him into the ring. I'm sorry, into the corner. Chad has him. Oh, and there's the knee. And now look at this, Chad Gable. Take down. But Damian Priest smartly rolling to the outside. But Gable to the top. And oh my god. He missed it in his leg. Landed the wrong way. Oh and oh now. Just a brutal move to the head. But Chad Gable seems unfazed. Getting right back to the action. And now there's a stop. He misses a kick, though. And now there's a attempted punch. Now there's another attempted punch that Chad Gable foils. But now Damian Priest has got him on his shoulders. Oh, and dropping him on the wing. And there's a six. Uh-oh, they need to get him back in the ring. Oh, my God. Chad into those steel steps. Oh, the way he hit it did not look good. Chad Gable now into the ring. And Damian Priest was trying to gl gloat. So now here's Chad Gable. Oh, belly to belly. Here's the pin to win it. No. Chad was looking for the upset right there. He could not get it. There's a punch. Gable has him. There's a suplex. There's a second. And I think we all know what this move is called. The three amigos. Is that enough? Here's a pin. And no. Oh, oh my goodness. Damien Priest just kicking out. Oh, I thought it was over there. Seeing how close it actually was. Now Chad Gable sends him into the ropes. Oh, and there's a kick. I thought Chad Gable had a chance. He does stop Damian Priest from doing whatever he was going to do there, though. And now, oh, a takedown. Just slamming his head on the floor. There's a punch. And now, look at this on his shoulders. Plant some. That might be enough to win it. Damien, no, a kick out of two by Gable now. It's back and forth so far. There's another punch. And now Damien Priest, south of heaven. He cleans this match. No, 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 no. Chad Gable will kick out. What a kick out by Gable, who just took down Damian Priest there. And now Gable sends him into the corner. Gable. I know he's about to. He's got a chance if he can hit this. Rolls up through Chaos Theory. The pin. Is that enough? Oh, no. Gable was so close. He just comes up short. Now a takedown by Priest. And oh no. Oh no, no, no. Priest looking to end it. No, there's an elbow by Gable instead. And now Gable's got a takedown. I thought I was worried for Gable. But he managed to stop the move. Come on, Gable. Oh, there's a kick. And look at. Oh my goodness, what a forearm. From and diving from the ropes. Here's a pin by Priest. Oh my goodness, what a kick out. Chad Gable showing all of his heart. And now, look at. Oh no, plant some. The spike. And now, no. Gable, come on, Gable. Don't quit. Don't quit. Come on! And oh no! And uh, this match is over! Another South of Heaven! And 
Damian Priest will pick up the victory. Chad Gable, man, he was doing so well. And then that spike seemed to have ended it. The plant just ended that momentum from Chad Gable. Look at this one more time. The fact that he kicked out gave me hope, but the south of heaven made sure this match was over. What a match there, folks. But anyways, thanks for watching this one. We'll be back with the next one in just a sec. So, folks, we're back for our next match on Monday Night Raw. And we've got the also energetic Dana Brooke. Dana Brooke. She's no longer the Rook. Dana Brooke been struggling to pick up victories recently and tonight. Having an open challenge. Looking to find the right opponent. But tonight we find out what she can do. And who their, her opponent is. Let's see. Let's bring out her opponent. Oh, yeah. Her opponent is the most beautiful woman on the planet. It is Carmella. She has a saying, Mella is money and when you look at her you've got to agree I mean she has got the looks but she's also got the skills in the ring to win matches Carmella a former money in the bank holder and Smackdown Women's Champion what did she do tonight find out look at that here we go Carmella in the ring she's not afraid to show off clearly anyway I better stop saying stuff like that here we go let's get back to WWE guys Carmella takes the open challenge against Dana Brooke and look at this Oh, and look at that, the elbow by Dana Brooke. And now Dana Brooke going down. Carmella with those hits. And when I said the, el the elbow by Dana, I meant by Carmella. Sorry, guys. But now Carmella is still beating up on Dana Brooke here. And now look at this. No, wait a second. Look at this. Dana's got Carmella. Takedown. Now slamming the head of Carmella on the floor. There's a kick to the back. And now there's a kick. And now Dana Brooke throwing Carmella on the floor. There's a kick to the face. And another. Dana Brooke trying to prove herself here tonight. And again throws Carmella on the floor. Hey. Don't mess up her looks, man. Oh, my goodness. Throws Carmella across the ring. And now Carmella getting back in. No, wait. She gets down. What's Carmella going to do here? Just walking away. And now... Oh, wait a second. A punch by Dana Brooke. Got Carmella. Oh, my goodness. Drops her onto the concrete. And now it ends a gurry by Carmella. Carmella has got Dana. Oh, and now pulling on the head of Dana, just stopping her. Super kick to the midsection. 
And now Carmella, there's the knee. There's another. And another. Carmella's got Dana Brooke. And now look at this. Dana Brooke. Swigs are around. And we're at a six count. Throwing Carmella into the barricade. A seven. Whoa, these two women need to get back in the ring. Well, there's a kick to the midsection. And now, Bulldog by Dana Brooke. A nine count. Get out of the... Get in the... Hey! Wow! A fraudulent victory. And there's Carmella getting back into the ring. Look at this. Just a, a, shake, a handshake? This is ridiculous. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching this match. Stay tuned. We'll be back. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Monday Night Raw. And we're going to get right into the action here. Introducing the opponent. First... Coming into this match, it is the King of Strong Style, Shinsuke Nakamura. And that's why you heard him there. And just like he said before, this is a triple threat match. So we don't have just two opponents. We have three. The question is tonight, who will come out on top out of those three? But before we get to answering that question, of course, we've got to introduce the two other opponents in this match. So how about we bring out that first opponent? Shinsuke Nakamura is going to have to face here tonight. Shinsuke, no rush to start this match. But anyways, here we go. Introducing Nakamura's first opponent. It is the Beast Incarnate. Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar. But anyway, Brock Lesnar making his way in to the ring here. Actually, no, never mind. He wants to take a minute to bask in some of the reactions. The fans cheering him here tonight. Clearly, not on the side of Nakamura. So, it's interesting to see a guy like Brock getting the cheers. Here he goes. He's getting himself into the ring. Brock Lesnar is a very intimidating man. Who stands down to nobody. But, of course, we have to introduce the last opponent, last competitor in this triple threat match. So, their final opponent in this triple threat match. The theme song will say it. Apollo Cruz. He's the wild card in this match. You wouldn't expect to see Apollo among guys like Nakamura and Brock Lesnar. But that could be a good thing. That could go in the favor of Apollo here. Because they if they underrate him, they may not focus on him as much as they do they each other that could give Apollo an advantage for not only stamina but his physical strength as it moves on to the match but of course 
That's all just speculation until the match starts. And I don't even think Apollo's going to win. Honestly, guys, I'm going to go Brock Lesnar. And I think that's the obvious pick in this matchup. Brock Lesnar's a beast. Apollo, not that same beast. Well, Apollo now. getting Trying to get the crowd behind him, but it doesn't look like he did so. So, Apollo ready. And these three staring down each other. And there's the bell. And now look at this. Just what I said. Look at this. Brock Lesnar starts against Nakamura. But now Apollo has got Brock. And Brock gets out of that. And oh, a shot to the leg. That is not an easy take. Both Brock and Nakamura missed there. Oh, there's a headbutt by Apollo. Brock Lesnar, definitely the fan favorite in this match. And the and of course the crowd favorite tonight. And when I mean fan favorite, I obviously mean who everybody believes is gonna win. And And now here we go, Lesnar got Nakamura on a German suplex across the ring. All these men are so fast-paced, I can't keep up with anything they're doing. Now Nakamura trying to shift the tide, uh, trying to change the tide. And now look at Apollo, powerbomb. And... There's an E. Apollo's got control of this match, but Brock Lesnar stuffs that out. Lesnar, oh no. Here's a pin. Oh, and a kick out very quickly by Apollo. And now, Brock on the ropes. And Apollo with a punch stopping Nakamura there. Nakamura, takedown. Now, here's a knee by Nakamura. And another. Nakamura can't get the kick. And now, Brock suplex. When a guy like Brock suplexes you, you come down hard. Apollo now flips. Take him down. And again. Apollo trying to take control now. But, of course... There's always the second man you got to worry about in this matchup. Oh, and Shinsuke showing him why he's got to worry about the other man in this matchup. Just pick it off. Taking the pieces from Apollo. And now look at this. Nakamura sent Brock into the ropes. They're turning to nothing. There's a kick. And now look at this, our bar, look at him win it, oh and down goes the ref, Apollo kicked the ref to stop the submission, and now Apollo with these attacks, there's a punch, but there's a an elbow by Brock and a takedown. Picks up Apollo, and with the ref getting back, here's an F5, but Nakamura back in the ring. Nakamura sends him, but the ref got in the way, so now Nakamura with the knee, and, and oh wow, what a kick to the back. And now here's a pin to Apollo, but Brock getting right back up. And now Brock Lesnar got him in the bear hug. The bear hug, Lesnar. Can he make Nakamura tap right here? And oh wait, there's an elbow. There's an elbow. Oh, and an elbow to Brock. Oh, and a knee to the midsection. Here's a pin. Is that a, no, there's a kick out. And now... Why the hell is the ref counting? Oh my god! Kid Sasha! Here's the ref with the pin. Brock kicks out. How did Brock kick out there? 
A lot of fans thought it was over, but of course it is Brock Lesnar we're talking about. Oh, and there's a takedown, there's a kick by Nakamura, and Apollo back to the outside. One of these men have a chance to take advantage on the elbow, and another in the... Look at that hole. Apollo screaming on the outside, and a right hand by Lesnar. There you go, there's a knee, there's a punch by Apollo. Takedown, the submission by Apollo. And Nakamura's not back up, but Brock tap, no. Nakamura breaks it up, and there's a kick by Nakamura. And now, Apollo into the corner. Oh, and now look at this, trying to separate his head from the rest of his body. Oh, wait, there's a kick to the midsection by Apollo. Tate, there's a clothesline, jumping clothesline. And now, picking up Nakamura. No, a right hand by Nakamura. But now, right hand by Apollo. Nakamura stopped him there. Brock now, suplex. And, oh my God. To the back of Brock Lesnar. And now here's Nakamura. There's a punch. Brock blocks that one. And oh, Apollo. Take him down. And now Brock Lesnar. Getting ready for those German suplexes. Suplex City. Here's a pin. Shit, Shitsuke, he's got to stop this. And it's broken up by Nakamura, who may have just seen this matchup. And, oh, Brock with a bulldog, stopping whatever Nakamura was planning. On oh, a kick right to Apollo, taking him down. There's a punch by Apollo. Now Nakamura throwing him into the ropes. There's a kick. And Brock, bear hug, bear hug. Brock's got it. Nakamura may not have anything else in him. Nakamura may have to tap. And, oh, no way. Look at Nakamura with those elbows, stopping Lesnar. And Nakamura with a takedown. Oh, and he missed an, a clothesline. Apollo trying to get something there. And now here's Nakamura with the knee. And now a kick to the back. And now picking up Apollo. And all right there, here's the punches. Down goes Apollo, who just got busted open by one of those punches. Look at Nakamura. With the... Kick Sasha! But there's Lesnar. Oh, down goes the ref! Down goes the ref! Brock Lesnar! Setting up! Sue! Plex! City! Boom! And now Brock's got Apollo Suplex! And now Apollo smartly rolling to the outside. Well, Brock Lesnar just attacking Nakamura. Brock Lesnar! And F5! Ref is back in the ring! This is to win it. There's Apollo! Look at this! Nakamura to the outside and Apollo! Sit out, power bomb! Here's a pin, one, and two. Nakamura on the outside, Apollo. Oh my God, he steals the victory. A huge victory for Apollo Crews in this matchup. How? How exciting. Anyways, thanks for watching this match. We'll be back with the next one, which is our co-main event. And welcome back to Monday Night Raw, folks. And we have got our next match coming up. And by the way, this is not 
the co-main event. I made that mistake. The next match is the co-main event. My bad, guys. But anyway, let's get their opponents, the opponents introduced. First, coming out, he is accompanied by Maurice. It is the Miz. The Miz. What an opportunity for him to come back to Monday Night Raw, improve himself. You know, we haven't seen him in a while. Of course, he's probably been creating one of his fantastic movies. Just the Miz, a generational superstar, folks. There's not much better than The Miz. And he's going to show that here tonight by destroying his opponent. But now, let's introduce his opponent. I've been talking a lot about The Miz. How about Miz's opponent? His opponent is a scum. Okay, this is a horrible man. This is the newest member of the Judgment Day. His name is J.D. McDonough. He was a great NXT superstar. But then it was revealed... That he was in cahoots with the Judgment Day. That threw everything, all the tallying out at the window. I mean, they're just a horrible group of people. Honestly, the only one who's really proved herself was Edge. Which I clear. I'm sorry. I meant Edge, yes. But also... Sorry, guys. Rhea Ripley. She has definitely proved herself a former NXT... And Raw and current Raw Woman Champion. But anyways, Jay McDonough and the Miz are ready to start this match. So here we go. Miz versus McDonough. Maurice in the Miz's corner tonight. That could come into play. But, of course, you know, J.D. McDonough has a whole group of members. That little cheater. But, anyway, here we go. And, oh, look at this. The Miz already starting off the match hot. Get, taking it to McDonough like he deserves. McDonough deserves to be pummeled tonight. Humbled. Pummeled. Whatever you say. Miz deserves to destroy this man, not only because the Miz is just that good, but because McDonough deserves to be beaten. And now, look at this! Miz, no care for what happens to McDonough, and he's in the right. This is not about caring about other wrestlers. This is about winning WWE matches and all. Look at this! McDonough, cheap kick there. A cheap kick. Oh, and now look at this. Trying to mess up the leg. What the heck is wrong with you? You ever heard of safety for other wrestlers? Good job, Miz. Taking out the leg of McDonough. Getting some revenge. Now look at this. And a right hand. And look at this. There's a stop. And oh, McDonough misses a drop kick. But a punch to the midsection. McDonough sends him outside of the ring. There goes the Miz. Miz now getting back up. Oh my goodness. As soon as Miz got back up, suicide dive. Clearly not prepared. Now just beating up the Miz. And now McDonough. Look at Oh, come on. The leg again. Leave his leg alone. This is ridiculous by McDonough here. Now, look at this. Oh, the kick. Drop kick. And now, picking up the Miz. Throws him into the ring. McDonough back in the ring here. And now McDonough on the rope. DDT. And here's a pin that the Miz is obviously going to kick out with ease. 
And there it is, of course. Of course, I'm going to say The Miz is going to win this matchup. He deserves to win this matchup, especially facing like somebody like McDonough, like I've said already. And now look at this, The Miz. Here we go. Giving his version of the yes kicks. We got the it kicks, folks. Here's the pin looking to beat McDonough. Oh, and there's a kick out. Miz thought he'd done it there. And now picking up McDonough. Miz, a skull, crushing, finale, here's the pin, no, kick out by McDonough there, I'm shocked, I'm shocked, anyways, here's the Miz, And now Miz, top rope, oh, with a punch to the midsection. And there's a kick to the Miz, and now McDonough's in control with some more cheap tactics tonight. Oh, and no, Miz blocks a headbutt. He had a knee. Oh, what a move there by the Miz. And now there's a kick to the face, and another... Miz has McDonough. Oh, there's a kick to the midsection. McDonough's got him. He'll drop him. It's called the judgment now. McDonough changed his finisher to judgment day. And now, and then, I'm going to call it judgment time. That goes a little better when you think about it. Judgment time. That sounds like a pretty good move. Especially when you see what McDonough is actually performing now. Here's the Miz again. Come on. All right. Miz with the eight kicks. Takes him down. Miz with a kick to the back. Miz with a knee. And now the Miz. Kick to the leg again. McDonough trying to get away from the Miz. And the Miz, oh, there's a knee by McDonough, stopping the Miz, but Miz taking control, skull, crushing, finale, oh, McDonough, kicking out, how'd he do it? Unbelievable! But now Miz elbow drop, and that should be enough to end it, folks. Miz, no, another kick out by McDonough. Wow! And now look at this, McDonough takes him down. There's a kick to the arm. Oh, and he misses an elbow. And now. McDonough barely hit the Miz, but he did nonetheless. And now Miz to the outside. He gets up. Miz doesn't even know where he is right now. Miz to the other side. Trying to avoid McDonough here. Miz trying to go to the crowd. Oh, my God. McDonough hit Maurice. Oh, wow. Anyways, thank you folks for watching. And McDonough hit the Miz. And now you can see the Miz staring him down. But we are on a time constraint here. So we're going to have to separate them. And we will be back for our co-main event. And here we go, folks. Our co-main event coming up. And this... Is going to be quite a match because first coming out your WWE World Heavyweight Champion Seth Freaking Rollins! Champion, 
Seth Rollins has been on top for a couple months now. And he looks to continue being on top. And now... Here we go. And now, Seth Rollins ready for his opponent. And his opponent, it is one half for the former. Undisputed Tag Team Champions Just keep fighting It is Kevin Owens Kevin Owens Is one of the greatest uh, wrestlers, what do you think about it? He has won every championship except for the one Rollins is holding right now. And if he does that, he becomes a triple. He becomes a Grand Slam champion. I mean, he would have been a triple crown champion if only he could have won on Saturday, which was what I was going to say until I realized they lost. But he could always, he could, he has a chance to become a Grand Slam champion if he can win this title. But it's not a title match, so let's get it started. There's a punch, and there's another KO DDT. And now there's the kicks, the stomps by KO. And again, the stomps by KO. And now he tried to go for it again. He missed. Now Seth Rollins got KO here. There's the elbows by Kevin Owens. And now KO has Seth, but no, Seth with those elbows. There's a punch. And now, oh, flies to the outside. And now Owens to the outside, but now Rollins with those chops. And now KO with those chops. Oh, my goodness. Rollins on the table. And there's a right. Oh, and there's a senton. And now, oh, my goodness. Into the post goes KO. KO right back up. I don't think he hit the like the whole thing. So at least there's that. But now here we go. Here is oh look at this. No KO flips him over there. And now KO has Rollins though. Rollins blocks the punch. There's a punch of his own. Rollins cross face cross face. And it, oh no, wait, KO rolls through. There's a kick to the midsection. And now, oh, German, but a rope break for Seth Rollins. And now punch the midsection. Seth Rollins and KO always keep on fighting. They don't stop. And KO has it on his shirt, so showing that he will never stop fighting. And now, look at this, another German. But what matters is whoever's the better wrestler. And heart has a little bit to do with it. But there's also the skill that takes part. They're both very skilled competitors, but the question tonight is who is more skilled? KO, top rope, Owen, now set to the outside. And oh, wow! He missed it out. Rollins missed. He lands on the concrete. And now KO taking advantage. Taking the punches to Seth's face. Now, oh my goodness, slamming his head on the concrete. Oh my god. The stops by KO. And oh, wait a second. There's a kick by Rollins right to the face. And now Rollins. Oh, there's a punch to the midsection. And now KO. Oh my god. Throwing him over. Oh. Rollins blocks the super kick. 
and a takedown, sweeping the leg of KO, and a DDT. KO now. What can he do here? No way Seth Rollins will throw him back in the ring. So, Rollins back in the ring here, and a close eye by KO. Picking up Rollins, and now KO, there's a punch, and a DDT. KO has Rollins, and now, pack it, no, wait a second, Rollins, there's a slam, taking him down, and now Rollins with the leg of KO, that is gotta hurt, and there's a drop kick, there's a punch by Rollins, and now there's a punch to the back, and another, and now throwing KO into the ropes and a slate blade by Rollins. Rollins with a kick to the arm and look at this. Rollins, curb, stop. And KO busted open. Is that enough? No. A kick out by KO. But Rollins with non-stop action, there's a knee. Not giving KO any rest. And oh, there's a stomp right in the forehead. And a kick to the back. Here's Rollins. Top rope. Elbow drop. And now, boom. Rollins bringing the fight to KO. Just like everybody thought he would. Seth Rollins, a fighting champ. Now there's the knee. Now what? Rollins waiting, stocking KO, but there's a knee. And now KO back into the ring. But Rollins has got him up on his shoulders. And throwing him on the rope. And now Seth Rollins, the knee to the back. Here's a pin. Is that enough to win it? No, KO with a kick out. Two and a half, two and a half. And now, look at this. Seth Rollins, no. KO got out of the way, whatever Seth was planning. And now Rollins got him, oh my God. Flipping him on his face. And Rollins now has KO. There's a kick. KO now, no, there's a kick by Rollins. No, there's a kick by KO. KO misses a clothesline and a German by Seth Rollins. Rollins, top rope, here he goes, and frog splash, looking to win it, right here, no, KO, kicking out, but now, no, KO out of the way, but now there's another kick to the midsection by Rollins, but now by KO, KO, stutter, here's a pin, and is that enough? And no! Seth Rollins kicked out KO in disbelief, but now KO setting up. Pop up power bomb! Here it is! To defeat the champ! No! A kick out by Kevin Owens. And the drop kick is missed by Rollins. And now, KO, no, there's a stop and a kick to the midsection by Seth Rollins. And there's a clothesline that he missed. And now there's a right. And, no, he missed there. And now there's an, a shoulder tackle, kind of. Rollins now, fly it. No, wait, no. That was KO. My bad, guys. Seth Rollins now. There's a kick to the midsection by Rollins. And now Rollins rolls up through Supergate. Rollins looking to put this match to an end. And he can do that. If he can take advantage here. And a non-stop attack by Rollins. There's a kick. And now, 
Wait a second, KO! And now, picking up Rollins. What's he gonna do? Summer kick! And with the count coming to an end! No, KO back to the outside will restart the count. And now KO! Look at this! Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh my god! On the barricade! The power bomb we've seen KO do that for years, and it's injured lots of superstars. A dangerous move. Now throwing him into the barricade, and now, oh my god! And there's the kick to the face, and an, oh, and another, and the kicks, and now Rollins with a D. We're at a three count. Oh, and now KO caught. Rollins with an elbow. Rollins didn't see it coming with how fast he was moving. And now, wait a second, Rollins lands on his feet. KO blocks that. Oh, code breaker. KO getting back up. It's a six count. Now, KO bringing Seth. And throwing him onto the barricade. And now, Rollins busted open. And now, KO back outside. He could take the easy victory, but that's just not KO anymore. Now, KO has Rollins. And now, dropping him on the barricade. KO with a with a assault in this matchup so far. KO is going down now. Seth Rollins has KO here. And he couldn't do anything there. And now Rollins into the post. And now KO into the ring. We're at six. And now KO back outside. We spent a while on the outside of this ring, and now KO, oh man! That could easily break the neck if KO wanted to. There's a kick right to KO! And now, a super kick! Rollins! And now picking him up, dropping him down. And now there's a punch, there's a chop, there's a punch, there's a chop. And now throwing him back into that barricade. And they really need to get in the ring here. And now dropping KO on his knee. And now Rollins back into the ring here. And what's Rollins going to do? Back to the outside. And there's a chop. And now Rollins has a piled suplex. Picking up KO again. There's a kick to the midsection. And now KO with a punch to the back. These two men have spent so much time on the outside that it seems like a false count anywhere match. And now, oh, there's the knee. And now, there's a knee by Seth. Oh, and there's a right. There's a knee. What six. And now Rollins. Dropping KO on the concrete, just throwing him. And now eight. And Rollins back to the outside. We're at one. And now finally, we're going to get back in the ring. Rollins trying to get that crowd behind him. And now back in the ring. KO out of nowhere. Stunner. And is that enough? Oh, it is. KO hit one out of nowhere. And he will get the victory in this matchup.
Where the hell did that stutter come from? Look at it. Where did that come from? It was enough to defeat Rollins. So, I hope you guys enjoyed our co-main event. I, it's not our main event. I won't make that mistake. But stay tuned, because we have our main event coming up as soon as we get back. Here we go, folks. We are back for Monday Night Raw. And this is our main event. And this is a number one contenders match for the World Heavyweight Championship. And first, coming out, the former World Heavyweight Champion. It is Drew McIntyre. McIntyre, ready to get this started. And you listen to him. And you could hear there, True McIntyre getting ready for this matchup here. But now, let's waste no more time with McIntyre, who clearly cannot wait to get this match started. Let's introduce his opponent, who will also be battling in this match, attempting to become the number one contender. His opponent, it is... The American Nightmare! The former Intercontinental Champion! It is... Cody... Rhodes! But I think... And I don't think you guys can wait just like I don't want to wait so, we are going to come back as soon as this theme song is finished to get this match started. We'll be back. And here we go with Cody Rhodes, who just got in the ring. Here he is. Cody Rhodes trying to get the, cr the crowd behind him, which I think they already are. And now it is time to get our main event started. Who? will be the new number one contender for Monday Night Raw. And oh, what a clothesline by McIntyre. And now a German suplex. And now picking him up. Power bomb. No waste here against Cody. And there's a punch right to the head of Cody Rhodes. And now neck breaker. Here's Cody, he's got McIntyre, but wait a second, there's the elbows by McIntyre. And now, got Cody, what a slam! And Cody now to the outside. And oh, look at McIntyre here. With a uh, close line to the chest. And now McIntyre picking him up. Oh no! A power bomb on the concrete by Drew McIntyre. And now here's Cody Rose with a clothesline. And now, oh, and a slap to the face. And now look at this. The, oh, he had it going, but no. Here's Cody Rhodes. No, wait a second. Drew's got him. And oh, look at the strength. McIntyre suplex. Oh, no, wait. There's an album by Cody. Trying to get something started here. Cody now. Oh, stay, guys. Now, look at this. The kick. No, wait. Yes, the kicks. 
There's a kick by Cody. Cody with a knee. What's he got here? Cody with a clothesline. Another clothesline. Blocks a kick. Sweeps McIntyre off his feet. And now here's a pin. Looking to win it right here. And oh, McIntyre kicks at it too. And now there's a slap to the face. And now look at this. He's throwing him over. Kick to the back. And now Cody Rhodes. No, there's an elbow by McIntyre. And now has Cody. Oh my God, look at the air. That was hang time. Oh, and a headbutt, the Scottish kiss by McIntyre. No, what? Oh, and a kick out by Cody Rhodes. McIntyre thought he may have had it right there. And now look at McIntyre with Cody again. Look at the strength once again by McIntyre. Suplex. And now McIntyre has Cody. Oh, and a Claymore. And McIntyre, no. Oh, Cody Rhodes kicking out. I thought that was going to be enough there for McIntyre, but no, Cody Rhodes had other ideas, and now there's a right. Cody, oh, drop kick. Is that enough? Here's a pin. And now a kick out at one by McIntyre. And now McIntyre trying to get to the ropes to safety. But I don't think that's any safe where he is right now. There's a right hand by Cody. But now there's a right hand by McIntyre. And now into the ropes goes McIntyre. There's a slam down. There's a kick to the back. And now Cody Rhodes with... McIntyre's neck. Oh no. That. Oh, that's painful. And now Cody Rhodes with a kick to the arm. There's a kick to the arm again of Drew McIntyre. No. McIntyre slams him down. Here's McIntyre. No, there's a kick by Cody. And now. Oh, there's a clothesline by McIntyre. And now. To the outside. McIntyre throwing him back in the ring. Here's Cody. And now, right hands. And now to the arm of Cody Rhodes. And McIntyre. Here it is. Claymore. For a second time. Is this it? No! Kick out by Cody Rhodes! McIntyre, if he couldn't believe the first one, he's definitely not going to believe that one. But now Cody Rhodes has even got control in this matchup. Cody suplex! And now look at Cody. Oh my god! Cody landed on his neck! And his chest at the same time. And he's acting like nothing happened. Cody fell hard. Oh, look at this takedown by Cody Rhodes. Cody might be running off of pure adrenaline after landing on his neck. But he got the crossroads. He is a pin. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my goodness. McIntyre managed to kick out. Cody Rose picking him up. Cody! No, there's a clothesline. And now, oh no. Oh, not to the chest. Oh my goodness. Cody Rose could pass out at any minute from what happened. And now taking down McIntyre. And now, there's the knee. And now look at this. Cody Rose calling up McIntyre. And, 
Oh, crossbody! Here's a pin! That might be enough! And no! Oh. Cody was so, so close! And I'm still worried for Cody here. Anything could happen. And now Cody calling out McIntyre. Cody Rhodes. Oh, no, 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 don't do that. Oh, my God, he missed. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. After what he went through earlier, that is not good. Oh, my goodness, and McIntyre. I don't think he realized what happened earlier. He was churned around when Cody Rhodes got hurt, and I don't think McIntyre would take advantage of something like that that could seriously life-threaten a superstar. But now, anyway, McIntyre, top rope. No, he missed the elbow. And now, Cody into the corner after McIntyre got back up. And, oh, no, he's got him turned around. That is not... A recipe for success if you're Cody Rhodes. And oh God to the neck. He has not felt pleasant. The Scottish kiss. And McIntyre. Setting it up. Climb oh no. Cody out of the way. But now McIntyre. Oh my God. What a slam. Oh, and there's a punch to the midsection. Cody, no. There's a kick to the midsection by McIntyre. And Cody to the outside. Please just count him out. Cody's gone through enough. Dear God. Oh, he's calling up Cody. No. No, no, no. Oh, wait. Cody got out of the way. There's a knee. Cody. With the arm. Oh. Cody's got McIntyre. And McIntyre throwing Cody. He looked like he was trying to get him in the ring, but that's not what happened there. And now Cody Rhodes stops McIntyre. And now Cody inside the ring. No, Cody back to the outside. Oh, what a slam by Cody Rhodes. Cody throws him into the inside. And now, oh no. Oh no, get all oh, the table being taken apart. Cody, top row. McIntyre getting back up. And... Cody, crossbody, looking for the victory. He's got it. Cody Rhodes gets the victory. And Cody Rhodes is the number one contender. But that's not what I'm concerned about, folks. Somebody check his neck. Somebody check his chest. Oh, man. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching Monday Night Raw. Thank you. If you did like it, like and subscribe. I will be back next time. Thank you and goodbye.